and welcome to Computercraft EDU with me, Wizard Keen. <laughs> I'm also joined today uh, by my little robot friends. Okay, um, that'll be uh, lo the lovely, the lovely Stampy Bot, Squishy Bot, uh, Larry Bot, and somewhere around here is I Ballistic Bot as well. I Ballistic uh, Turtle, uh, who is guarding the downstairs bit with his lovely moustache as well. His moustache. Oh, look who's coming to greet me today, little zombie. Let me just tap you away, tap you away. Great. G good. Lovely. Now, uh, if you saw last week's episode, I I, I kind of uh, spent a long time doing nothing, and then I decided to program uh, StampyBot to create a cube. Well, a wooden cube. So, this is what we're going to do. We're going to try and create a house. Uh, so... If I could train you to break it all down at the same time, probably, but uh, until this time. So what we did, we created this thing here. So if I get a stampy bot to go up, move up one, and then press play, you can see that we've got a stampy can basically create a level, a cube, a cube level. Now he's doing this uh, pretty smartly, actually. Uh, it's a lot of repeating blocks, uh, and I'll just when he's finished over here, I'll show you what it looks like inside. There we go, perfect. So what this looks like, that program looks like that. It says repeat four times, do, and then we're running a level cube, which is this one here. And this is just repeat four times, do, select a slot. That just selects this slot here, his first slot in his inventory, uh, which is one, and then place down a thing and move forward and then end. Once you've repeated that four times, then at the end of that repeat repetition, Dum 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 four times that places four blocks in a row as he moves forward. Then he mo oh what it hey, wait hey, wait hey, wait steady no you don't no 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 bad zombie. Um, after that happens he moves back one because he's moved forward one. He turns right and he moves forward one so he gets in position to do the next line of four. And then he does it the same, next line of four. And that's where we repeat that four times. So what I haven't got is uh, in this one here, once we've done that, he can actually move up. Okay. And then we're going to do another one, which is going to be called cube. I think we'll just call this one cube. Yeah, we'll call it cube. Cube. All right. And cube is going to be is going to be repeat uh, four times because it's four by four by four, right? Okay, four times do. Um, we're going to do run the level program, and we're going to end. That should do it, right? Oh, it's getting dark. Where did the day go? <laughs> uh, I better go on to snip to bed. This is, as you remember, this is a survival server series. So I'm um, actually, uh, I have to wait for night time. There we go. Uh, I have to kind of, I'm looking after myself. I'm kind of building stuff. Uh, so there is, you know, it's good. I'm getting the robots to do all my work for me. So that's quite helpful. Let's stamp you, bot. Let's move you over here. So it's going to turn you, move you backwards. Let's look through your eyes. Okay, we're going to build it over this side over here. Let's be a testing ground. Move you down. Oh, I've got to move you up one. So you've always got to slightly hover above the ground. That's going to be okay. And it, it this won't make the roof or produce a door yet. And that is what we want it to do at some point. But we won't get there just today. Well, oh, we might do actually. So let's think. Let's let's look about where he ends up first of all, because then I'll from from that point of view, I can then think about how to create a door and how to create a window and stuff like that. Okay, so this is like a small, the smallest house possible. So we'll run the program. Okay. And once I've figured out where he's ending up, then I can think about I can actually program him to move into position. So he's doing that kind of stuff. This is great. While he's doing that, actually, let's break let's break all this away. Uh, 
Okay. He's doing great. He's doing great. Uh, I haven't found out, by the way, those people who watched last episode, I haven't found out yet if they can detect entities. Um. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Has he run out of stuff? I bet he's run out of stuff. Yeah. Ah, sausage. That's no good. That's another thing that I was worried about. That if 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 he runs out, there's no and like there's no way of checking that slot yet. I say yet because I think there will be there will be an opportunity at some point to uh, f refill up. Maybe I should do that now. Bit of a pain. <laughs> it's a bit of a pain, right? Rewriting the entire script because I think I'll have to kind of. I don't know. I might be able to go right back to the beginning. Um, <clears throat> move down. Oh, stop that. Move down. Move down. Let's have a look at the program. It's going to be in level cube. Select slot one. Let's have a look. If let's have a look. If. If is there a if compare inspect block? I don't know if you can actually compare the slots if slot is empty. Item count. Wonder that. I wonder if that means item count in your inspect item. Let's just try a new one. Let's do this. Let's do um, if right um, select slot. I can't do that. Detect if inspect item. Okay. Um, but how do you know which item you're inspecting? Uh, if 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 expected, oh yeah, boolean. Okay, so um, <clears throat> add boolean, which would be any of these. Maybe I've got to. Maybe I've got to do this. Maybe I've got to do this. Select a slot. Okay, which would be slot one. And then I go if if inspect item equals um, no, not hello world <laughs> is less than one. Maybe I just got to do is is does not does not equal. not it that is not it I've got to do a number it does not equal expected boolean kit add, add a string add a string up or then uh, then let's take all this stuff out because I'm going blind a little bit then say uh, Hello world. And end. Run. Yeah. Yeah. See that's that's not happy there. But it is there. So if um if item count. No. If false x, <clears throat> if 
yeah, selects dot one if yeah I don't know if uh, inspect block but that's like in above and below it's not not really what I want to do let's delete this one yes and uh, we'll have a think about it because it's it's making my head hurt right now so let's just let's go ahead with this we should have enough stuff in there so I'm gonna keep filling that up uh, and then we can kind of think about it I'm sure you guys are probably thinking well you know the answer if you do know the answer do let me know in the comment section below uh, so my brain cannot melt all over the place okay um, but I know I'm on the right track somehow let's, let's, let's break the rest of these blocks up here and then we can kind of let Stampy do his thing so he's basically going to do four layers uh, of the house and then I'm going to find out where he's going to be on top once I find out where he's going to be on top I'm going to think about how to position him to make a door he's going to basically break open a door bit select another slot with a door in and add a door and then I'm going to think about windows and other bits and pieces so we shall see he's doing not too badly is he okay next level there we go this is great he probably didn't need to go four layers thinking about it because normal like you know how's we could have broken these two bits here but anyway anyway and it's you know it's a cube it's not that entertaining and he should just stop there okay so that's where he stops so um, we want him to turn right okay I'm gonna write this down <laughs> turn right move forward one two forward one two one two and then move right again and that'll face him forward should it move right forward yeah and then and then move forward okay right and then he's got to move down one two three four five move down five five times five and then break a block and then move down one and then break a block okay so I've written all that stuff down I'm gonna I'm gonna open this up oops a daisy come on okay go in here and <clears throat> I'm actually gonna put it at the end of here so we're gonna do it pretty long ways okay so it's gonna it was gonna move right then it was gonna move forward and forward and then move right again okay and then move forward okay and then move down five move down one two three four five then it was going to break a block and then it would uh, break a block yeah. and then it was going to move down one and then break a block and then move down one and then move forward and I think that should do it right uh, I'll grab him again ah stop 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 let's get all that in there so let's put him into position over here somewhere actually over there you see that place over there we'll, we're gonna do it over there okay moving forward right okay cool I think that should do it is he above the thing that is perfect right stampy bot off you trot I'm gonna go to bed <laughs> and I'll see you in the morning uh oh zombies coming I might not be able to make it into bed zombies too close come on there we go made it just in time Okay, zombie outside now. Won't be a time to a problem. Hello, goodbye. There we go. Perfect. Let's see how he's getting on. Okay, good. Okay, so he's on two layers up here. Let's see how he gets on this. Um, see from above. See from above. Okay, third layer. 
This is great. I'm going to probably program a teardown house as well. So one, one, when Stamp is building this one, I can get another little robot to kind of uh, stop, you know, tear down his old house for me. That would be rather good. So he should open up a door right here. Let's wait. Let's see if it happens. Okay, any minute now. I'll have some soup. Yum. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Where's he gone? Nothing's happening. Oh, oh no. He did. He did it wrong. He. Um, something went wrong, didn't it? Let's go up here. See where you got. I bet you say movement obstructed. So he moved too far. Um, yeah, maybe he didn't need to move that one. So I'll get rid of that. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna move you back. Okay. One up. And turn you round. Move forward a little bit, turn around over here, and go. Oh, no place. Move you up a bit. And oh, fill this up as well. Fill that up. We need a totally fresh, fresh things at that. Where have you gone? Where have I gone? Oh, you're up there. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's too high. You're way too high. You don't need to be that high. Go. So he's off. So theoretically, this should work. Okay. But, you know, I've been wrong before. <laughs> but he's going to make quite a big tower this time. Uh, so um, let's cut to him finishing it up. Uh, so we're just not wasting any time. And you can see whether this has worked or not. Okay, here he goes. No, here he goes. There he is. And he moved down. He moved down one. He should not maybe have moved down the last one. Um, are you behind this one? Why did you move down the last one? Movement obstructed. What did you want to do? Oh, he was supposed to dig, move down, dig, and that was it, really. That was it. He didn't need to do that one. He could have just moved out. That would have done it. Okay, so we've solved that problem. Um, he didn't even move bad. He could just actually place a door. Uh, place. Oh, choose a slot. Select a slot, uh, which will be slot 16. Okay. And then place in front like that. And then we could just put a door in slot 16. Uh, and you can find out what happens next week <laughs> in the next Computer Craft. Uh, episode because I'm going to finish up now. Okay, so just again, thanks very much for watching. I will see you all later. Bye!